Welcome to another edition of the most consistent, prolific, and dedicated uploads in YouTube history. This is the Dynamic Sean's View Entertainment on YouTube.com. Make sure to like this video and subscribe with a major at update as concerns the raw rating viewership for this week. And now this is a huge momentum booster. This is a major positive for the WWE moving into the Royal Rumble on the WWE Network. Monday's episode of WWE Raw featuring the Raw reunion theme drew... A monumental, and this is monumental, this is definitely major, 4.100 million viewers, up 5% from last week's 3.905 million viewers. For this week's show, Raw, the first hour drew 4.292 million viewers, the second hour drew 4.135 million viewers, and the final hour drew 3.874 million viewers. So as you can see, the rating, the viewership did go down hour to hour once again, but it was able to hold steady with a 4.100 million viewers, and this is great for the WWE. Um, you know, it was a solid show. It was well written. It was well put together. You know, there wasn't times where I was thinking about, well, should I switch the channel? I'm not interested. I'm not invested. But you know what? There was a lot of Hall of Famers. There was a lot of legends. There was a lot of icons. It also featured the return of Sting. Sting's explosive Raw debut. But once again, that number could not hold true in the end uh, as concerns the third hour. But it's still good news for the WWE and the impact because now all eyes are on the Royal Rumble. Or all eyes are on the prize for the WWE World Heavyweight Championship. So I think this is a major positive for the WWE. It's a step forward. But the thing is, now they're not going to be having legend reunions every single week on Raw. Are they going to be able to keep that rating up? Are they going to be able to maintain it? Are we ever going to see a 5 million viewership again? Are we going to ever see Attitude Era-like ratings once again? Well, the WWE certainly seem like they're on their way. I know we, you know, they could take a backpedal. I mean, just because this week's great, a, a strong rating, doesn't mean that's going to keep up. But if you have great writing, good, solid matches, uh, good in-ring promos, the performers are going out there and maximizing the most of their time, and you give something to the viewers that, you know, draws them in, you're going to get a good rating. And I think this rating really represents what WWE Raw was all about this week. We come on here week in week and talk about how the WWE sucks, but this time they pulled through. Subscribe.